Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Hey, it's time for another everyday getaway. Today we are headed off to Smith Mountain Lake State Park. It is about 45 minutes from our house here in Lynchburg, and it is a beautiful lake with tons to see and do, so we will get you there and show you as much as we can. We're just going to grab a quick biscuit from Biscuitville, get a little bit of breakfast, and then we'll head off to the lake. See you in a bit. in Manita, Virginia, which is in Bedford County. And uh, we taught in Bedford County for many years. So we just want to take a quick shout out to Forest Middle School and uh, um, all you teachers, staff, students who are getting ready to go back and students across the country who are getting ready to go back to school. We just um, hope you have a great year and a safe year. We are at the marina and in the marina area, there's a lot to, to do. There are some shops here. So if you like to go shopping, this is the spot for you. Some little restaurants, coffee shop, um, there are boat rentals and some different things that you can rent here. We'll talk about putt-putt. There's just a lot of fun things. So we'll kind of take you around and let you see this area and uh, show you what some are some things that you can be doing here. So Bryce grabbed some coffee at the Smith Mountain Lake Coffee House. How was it Bryce? It's pretty good. I got a black nitro cold brew, uh, but it looked like they had really great pastries in there and they used the Homestead Creamery milk, so next time I'll have to try something else. Alright, we're at Bridgewater Marina and that's where you can pick up some boat rentals and or if you've made rentals you can pick them up here. And you can also feed the fish, which we love. You can get the popcorn inside the Bridgewater Marina. It's a dollar a bag and it is just for fish food. Ducks love it too. So we ran inside BW Marina and we got one of their price sheets to check out. Um, if you take a look at it right here, you can kind of see the prices, the layout of everything. Um, they've got the wave runners, the pontoon boats, the starcrafts. Looks like they range around 150 an hour and then the more you go up, so if you want like a four hour for a wave runner, it's only 240. Um, you can rent up to seven days and um, however they do have price increases for the weekends and busy weekends and holidays. But you can check this out at bwmarina.com. And speaking of rentals, when we got here, this place was pretty much filled and it is, um, there are a lot of people and a lot of the boats have gone out already and people waiting. So I think that probably if you don't have reservations, I think they fill up pretty quickly. So you have to get here early. And uh, like I said, most of these spaces were filled when we got here and we haven't been here that long, but they're getting taken up quick. So Smith Mountain Lake covers over 20,000 acres and has over 500 miles of shoreline. It is a beautiful large lake. There are a lot of people here today. Um, it is Friday morning and we had a lot of rain last night but it's cleared off today and there are a lot of people already on the lake. It's about 11 in the morning and there's so much space and so much beauty here. There's something for everybody. So when you're taking a break from the lake and you want to come walk around on the boardwalk, there's a couple things you can check out. We've got an arcade right here, Fun and Games Arcade. Right now masks are required. I'm sure they're doing their best to sanitize everything and keep it clean. You also have the option to go check out the Rock Wall or there's the Harbor Town Golf. Um, everybody loves the mini golf at the lake or at the um, beach, so that'll be fun to do. Also, at night, um, they have local music, bands playing and everything, so you can come, have There's a drink, have boy. food, and enjoy yourself. So we left the marina where we were, and we traveled to a different portion of the lake uh, so that we entered into Smith Mountain Lake State Park. There is a $7 parking fee right now. I think it does change 
fall of the year. But for now, it's $7 to come in, and we are at a boat launch. There's a dock that you can fish off. Actually, a little more of a little pier than a dock, but a little pier that you can fish off of. And uh, we're gonna fish for a little while, and then we'll see what else we can get into. It is a beautiful day out on the lake. It's in the mid 80s, but there's a beautiful breeze blowing and found a nice shade tree while the guys are fishing. And just wanted you to have a chance to see the beauty and enjoy a little bit of the sound of the water smashing against the rocks here. So this, this is the beach area for Smith Mountain Lake and there's a good amount of space to swim and a nice beach area. The, the fees for swimming, it's $3 for adults, $2 for children 2 to 12 and under the age of 2 is free but it does cost a dollar extra on the weekend. And there are some boat rentals here as well and there's a nice snack bar and a pavilion that's covered and it looks like the tables have been uh, marked off so that you can socially distance while you eat it even at the snack bar. And there are lots of picnic tables and picnic areas close by this beach area. Hey, thanks for joining us at Smith Mountain Lake this morning. We've had a great blast and um, thanks for joining us. And I'll see you guys in a couple of weeks when I get back from Nashville. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.